Hello everybody and welcome back to Story of Seasons. Where, oh, it is God's birthday today. It is also a Saturday. Okay. Not a day. Not a day for anything like uh, recipes or anything like that. I can't wait for the winter time to use my little, oh, my little fireplace. How cute is that? Anyway, uh, it's not a Wednesday either, so it's not a day to go and check on, on what's his face. Um, we don't have a festival on the 15th, which is great. Some people were saying they did have a festival on the 15th, so it must be... It must be, uh, slightly random. Maybe it's, like, depends on... It will always be on, like, the fourth when... Sorry, the... Second Wednesday. And if the second Wednesday happens to fall on the 15th for you, then that's just tough luck. Maybe that's a thing. I don't know. Hello, Carter. Good morning, Sheila. We plan to hold our annual concert in the church tomorrow at 6pm. I came today because I'd like you to participate as a performer. Will you join us? Of course I will. You will? Wonderful. I prayed you would. I'm thinking of having you play the ocarina. I'll give the instrument to you tomorrow. Please don't be late. Come to the church at 6pm. I will. That's fine. I'll get that done. Don't you worry. Hey, my little dudes. Okay, let's let everybody out because it's a nice sunny day today. Everyone wants to come outside. I wonder if I'll get any new babies today. I think I may have just brushed the bell. <laughs> right, is anybody in here pregnant? Right, let's get all the eggs. I think we do have a pregnant rabbit and I think we're due to get our first 10 heart rabbit. And I think once we've got that, then we won't need to get new ones, which will be amazing. But that does mean you need to be fed. Hello, Alison. Would you like this? There you go. Are you happy? Three days to go. So that might be this episode. It might be next episode. We'll have to see. Um, let's put in all the eggs. I think I didn't have time to put a load of the eggs in yesterday. So, like... I've got all this produce still that needs to be processed. I think I think it's because because yesterday I was trying to plant all the plants. Look at all these plants that I planted, but there are still plants that have not been planted. Oh right, yes, I remember what happened. It's been a little while since I, I did this, but oh what have I planted everywhere though? Oh my goodness. It's going to be a nightmare to know what I've planted in all different places. Well, well. Um. Oh, I know. <laughs> so that one is eggplants at the end, and then I think it's the like kidney bean things, and then there's another five things of something else I need to plant as well. So I'm going to need another two eggplant, another two of the uh, adzuki beans, I think it is. And then something else for that other row. Do I have any other things I wanted to plant? I can't, I, I just had a complete brain fart, you know, and I just... Summer, summer, spring, 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 summer, summer, summer. Yeah. Uh, and, and things just, just got a bit out of control, honestly. Oh! Cool. I got it the Vans thing, the Vans special thing. So I'm gonna run right up to the shop. It is a Saturday, I hope that means I'll be fine. Should go in there and buy things. Yeah, we're good. So yeah, it's the first time in ages that I've actually been able to go to, oops. I've actually been able to go to the shop at a decent time and I've messed and I messed that up. So two eggplant seeds, please. Also two more yam seeds, please. No. Not yam. Azuki bean. Two more Azuki beans. That's okay. And then maybe I could either plant chili peppers or I could plant carrots, maybe. I 
Do I not have spinach? I do not. So there might be something I still need to ship for that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna get some carrot seeds just in case that's what I need to do. So I'll get five carrot seeds. Thanks, Jeff. So I, I think that at this point the grass is strong enough to cope with the animals um, munching on it, but I'll have to keep an eye on it. If it starts to look a little bit ropey, I'm going to have to keep them in. Um, and maybe year three will be my year. <laughs> year three will be my year for grass being really cool in my place. But we need to get all the weeds out of the way. Oh yeah, that, that looks like it's going to be robust enough. They're having a little munch on it, but they're, they're not making too much of a dent, so that's really good. Okay, I'm going to just like trim it back a little bit, and then if I do need to just uh, feed them tomorrow, that's cool too. Oh, hang on. I've got a full inventory full of stuff. I want to go see the Harvest Goddess today as well. And then we'll go and see Got as well. I think with Got, if I go and see him and give him some honey or something, remember his birthday. Mind you, on his birthday, uh, I might be struggling actually. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Apparently Forgotten Valley, people have been saying in the comments because I was wondering about it. And apparently Forgotten Valley is... Oh no. Uh, out of like previous games, it's like a bit of a, a throwback to things. So it's not something I can go to Brandon with. If I stand out here long enough, I wonder if God will come out. I don't... Harris, do you know where Got is? Hello there, how are you doing? Have you caught wind of any strange or unusual activity? Ha 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 ha, no, I'm sure you haven't. Well, actually, I did find a bear in the forest. If that's what you're talking about. My image is so full. I'm just waiting around in case Got comes out because that's the only way I'm going to see him. I don't even think he's a particular one for going to the pub at night. Maybe he would on his birthday, I don't know. Maybe I'll check that out later, just in case. If I don't see him, I'll go check the pub. And if he's not there, then there's not a lot I can do. If you just don't find someone on the birthday, then you just don't find them. I don't think it's going to cause me too much of an issue. What am I doing? That's inventory, that's what I want. Um, it's not going to cause me too much trouble because I think he's already pretty high up with me uh, as far as social is concerned. The only one I'm struggling with is Grey. And most people are at four or five notes now. Even like the lowest ones. Even Carter's at five. Except for Cliff. Poor Cliff. Even Kai's at five. Oh yeah, God, so he needs like one more musical note. So really... I can just go and see him later. Um, people are saying apparently that's a yellow heart, not an orange heart. To me, that looks pretty orange, but I think there's going to be a more orangey orange one coming up. Um, and yeah, so if I just keep going to all the stuff with Brandon, all the, the little events and things, I, ugh, I need to sort this inventory out. If I go to all the little events with Brandon, then we should be good for that. Right, so let's sell my large... Ooh. Oh yeah, six large mayonnaises, gold mayonnaises, and then head into the barn and we're just going to process the rest of the stuff. I also want to put some stuff in the fridge actually. Get into this fridge and I'm going to put all the grass away. Oh, I forgot to see the harvest goddess. Also, I need nine of those. Oranges are very good gifts. I imagine chocolate cookies are too. I had some really good chocolate. Avat got us some pizza earlier. And I got cookies with it. Like, you know the, the like cookies that you get from pizza place are always like really melty and nice. And they were them. And they were so good. <laughs> 
Okay, so how are we doing, you guys? Squeezel got four days. Ruth got 17 days. I will feed you both. I think I'll need to take a care pretty soon. There's a fluffy festival coming up. I do need to take care as to when that is. Oh, I'm so silly. I forgot that I don't have a uh, a fleecer. Oh yeah, <laughs> let me make it strawberry cheese. You should have a cranberry cow and then you can make cranberry cheese. That's so good. Or apricot cheese. Right, okay, so let's go make the fleece. The fleeces are gonna, oh, actually no, the uh, strawberry milk as well. Probably poison mushroom should go. <laughs> Don't really wanna keep that. I could put the flour into my flour vase and the lumber needs to go away. And then I really do kind of need to go to the mines at some point as well. Maybe I will do that today. I haven't used a ton of my stamina up. Could make a load of popcorn or something. Oh, look at all those pineapples, they're worth so much money. I'm actually going to eat those chocolate cookies, I've decided. Nom nom. They're mine. <laughs> Put the flour in the vase. Okay. I'm going to put the lumber away. And then I want to go get like just some like really basic. Oh, and that van stuff. Apparently, I can sell that to Huang though. Should we go and try it? People have been on at me to do that, so I'm gonna try it. Oh, tomorrow. We'll try it tomorrow. <laughs> we'll try it tomorrow when he's actually open. Oh, actually, no, I might make it. No, I won't make it in time. It's like four that they close. Um, so we'll do that tomorrow. In the meantime, I'm going to process all the wool and then go to the Harvest Goddess. Hey guys! Now at the moment, everything I make is uh, better as yarn. Everything is better as yarn. However, pretty soon, some other stuff that I make will not be. If I can get like a good fluffy festival um, thing. So that should be about 3,000's worth, just under 3,000's worth of just pure yarn today. And about 2,000's worth. So I made about 5k just in animal products. Probably a little bit more actually. I haven't even milked the cows yet. Right, okay. I also need to plant some stuff, don't I? And I will probably... Hello, Zach! I might need to water it as well because I've taken literally so long to get around to it. We'll just tidy these fields up. And I'll get the planting done. So this is eggplant. I'm so glad there was a key as to what I planted where. Otherwise I would be in much, much trouble. Why have I got one yam seed left? Ugh. Planted enough yams. Oh, I think I was gonna have a second row of yams, wasn't I? Well, we'll do carrots. We'll do carrots, it's fine. See, I remember what I was planning now. So we've got five carrot seeds and we've got two adzuki bean seeds. That should be enough to fill out my fields. And it does mean I'll need to change over the carrots every so often. Well, that's cool. I can do that. I'll do a bit of watering and I'll I'll go I'll actually go and see the harvest goddess then. Spent all day saying, I'll go see that harvest goddess at some point. Blah blah blah. And then I don't do it. You guys are like, when are you gonna go see her? She's up, come on. 
And I'm like, mm, maybe later, maybe in a minute. Blue, blue, blue. One. Two. I've been learning a hard game today. I've been learning Crusader Kings 3. That's a very hard game. Compared to something like, like this one, it's, uh, it's very, very different. <laughs> this feels like a breath of fresh air that I don't have to think about as much. But I do still have, you do still have to think about it though. Like, you, I wouldn't say this is completely brainless because there are things that you have to remember and it's orders of things and it's, it's like kind of a uh, prioritization and things like that. Maybe, maybe that's just what I'm bad at. <laughs> Oh, I don't think so. I think I'm doing reasonably well, actually. I think the only thing that I regret a little bit, number one, is that um, I was a little bit not as on top of the horse early on as I could have been. And uh, number two, that I let Cliff leave without realizing. So if I did a, another playthrough of this, which I probably won't, because I think really once is enough with these kind of games. But, so like if I was doing something else, I'd maybe like pick up something like Rune Factory or something like that instead. Just to go through that instead. But anyway, um, I, that's, the, that's the, the only things I would really change. I'm going to let that grass just grow all the way up to the top. But I think... This grass is now uh, at the point where it's pretty stable. You should be able to let the animals out most days except for the rainy days. Okay, harvest goddess and then sleep. And I'm sorry, God, you never showed up on your birthday. I did try and hang around outside your house a little bit. But you just so happen to have a birthday, birthday on the day. Well, if it isn't she lab how lovely of you to come see me again i always appreciate an offering oh i'm rather fond of this how wonderful thank you bye lovely yeah um it sometimes it just so happens that the, the the day that their birthday falls on happens to be on a day where their place is locked up and it's like well if that's the case then it's just that's just tough that's just life I have rather a lot of fodder in my inventory right now. I, I really don't think I'm gonna have time to go to the mines today. I keep saying that the entire time. I'm gonna go to the mines, guys. Totally gonna go to the mines. It's gonna be so great. And then I don't do it. I have milking to do. I did feed all of the animals. Oh no, now she loves falling over. Now she loves me to eat popcorn just so she can milk her cows. Is Lolly pregnant right now? No. It's Rue that's pregnant, isn't it? Casey's not pregnant. Oh yeah, I, I need to leave some of them fluffy, don't I? I'll leave that one till tomorrow and I'll scope out who's who's fluffy and who's not fluffy and all that sort of thing. Rose is still an adolescent by the looks of it. So I think it was Rose Cthulhu who's underneath a Rose actually. I think it might have been Cthulhu that I just brushed there. Or was it? I don't know. Uh, that's Rose I brushed. Rose. Rose. Cthulhu's butt sticking out there. Well, I tried. Um, and also, I do need to brush through. And I do need to brush Squeezel, I think, still. Not twice, though. Man. Save the kill. So, I have a little look here. So, we've got Rue now up to seven hearts. We will definitely have an eight heart cow by next year. Who the 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 one that Rue gives birth to? I will brush and talk to you every day as much as I can up until that cow festival. 
and hopefully then it'll be a golden milk producing cow because really it does seem that you really only need to get them up to like eight to get the golden milks and things like that. I would love to have one that was like a 10 star one, but I don't think I'd be able to get that through the cow competition until like year four and I don't know if I'll even be playing that long. So I love getting all the chickens and everything through the festivals, but it's like, it takes so, so long. And really, I just want to get married and, and have a big mansion. That's all I want in this game. So yeah, Squeezel, Rue, Cthulhu and Rose, who I have spoken to. Mona is a winner of the chicken contest. So next year, I'll, I'll put like Ixius, Gin or Trist through and see if I can then start getting a year with like two gold eggs every day, which would be amazing. Alison is pregnant with my first 10 heart rabbit right now, which I'll hopefully be then sort of trying to level up enough to win the fluffy contest. The only one capable, I think, at the moment of possibly winning this fluffy contest is Maple. I haven't even spoken to Maple today. That's so bad. I haven't spoken to the chickens. I might get to sleep by like 10 o'clock. It's important to talk to them. Mabel and Hop. And Alison is pregnant with three days to go. With another lullaby, I think. Lullaby Mark Three. <laughs> okay, let's go home. It's really late. And I'm really tired. We did it we had a good day though, a really good day. I'm just hyper aware of, like, not, um... Scuppering myself for the Fluffy Festival, which is not until the 18th, no, 9th, hang on, 9th? Is that Fluffy Festival? It's a Harvest Festival. Fluffy Festival's on the 21st. Oh, I got blinking loads of time! Loads of time, guys! So much time! That's fine then. I don't need to worry about that at all. It's a nice sunny day again. Um, but the grass is starting to just, I, I, I don't know if you guys noticed, but it's starting to look just a touch patchy. Over here, so what I'm thinking, and today is the concert. Uh, so I'm thinking today we'll just let the chickens out, but I'm going to just feed these guys inside. Because what I don't want... No, no, I would get along faster. Probably Rue's baby, I will maybe try and hand feed every day. I think I have something like 10 dudes in here. You're all in my way. Right, so I am going to share Casey today. Come here, Casey. And I am going to milk everybody else. Well, all the cows, anyway. Buttercup, Lolly, and... And bubbles all need to be milked. I honestly think it's possible that how long it take. You know, um, at the end of their pregnancy, where sometimes it takes a couple of extra days. I wonder whether that's where, like, there's days where you missed feeding. Again, like, there is nothing in this game, I don't think, other than, as I say, maybe, like, things like Cliff, his storyline. Nothing other than that makes it worth having to play again. Because you're always going to find that you... What was I going to say? Because um, you're always going to find that they're, they're, they're just an, playing it for a little bit of extra time if you just didn't do something quite as efficiently as you wanted to. A little bit of extra time will generally fix it. Let's 
it's all nice and even. Nice and crisp and even. Sounds like a good roast chicken. Why am I always thinking about food? I have no idea. <laughs> We're talking about pizza and roast chicken in this episode. Right, let's get these guys out. More, more hours out you get, the quicker you're going to do platinum eggs for me, eh? Yeah, that's right. I'm going to quickly feed Allison and uh, grab all the eggs. We'll go see the harvest goddess. I might spend a little time in the mines trying to get some copper and some gold because I want something. I'm running out of copper and I need something to give as a present to Saibara and Grey when I, when I run into them. Not that I've been doing much running into the villagers this episode, but you know, if I do run into them, I'd like to make sure I have something to give them. And also we wanted to go and do and and see if we can sell Van's favourite to Huang. Because we think that Huang so I'm really pleased because I'm only going to have to buy like three more rabbit breeding kits. This is going to be so good. And then I'm done, like I'm done with the chickens now. Oh. You know what, I'll do that later. Um, that doesn't matter. I'm going to go and see Huang first and then we'll go see the Harvest Goddess and then I've got a concert to go to at six. Mustn't forget. I can chuck. Like, I can chuck that into the, the processor tomorrow if I want. As long as I've got the milk off the cows, the rest does not matter unless I'm literally saving up for something. I've got 44k now. I wonder if I should just put a yarn maker in the barn. What's this? A log pile. And there's uh, someone constructing something down here, I wonder. Will there be like some special thing going on in year three? Lax fisherman friend comes back. Oh, what? Why is it locked? Is it because it's a Sunday? I bet it's because it's a Sunday. And obviously it's autumn, so Kai's place won't be open. Oh, that's a nightmare. Well, that's fine. Or maybe because it's a festival day as well. We will try again next episode. I'll, I'll keep it on my hot bar and we'll keep trying. Okay, so it's not too much of a stressful day today, honestly. Can I even go in here? Everything's locked up. It's like one of those festival days where everything just like like gets locked up and it, it, you can't do anything. So it might that actually might be a good day to go in the mines. I'm just gonna. Am I gonna make any food to do this with? Is the question. Udon would be the one to do for this. Uh, if we can find it. And I can make 19 of them, so let's just make 9. Just make a stack of 9. That should be plenty just to go through the mines a little bit. Especially with, like, mithril tools. So, because I'm going to be doing that, I definitely do not want any, like, lumber in my inventory. Uh, I don't know, I don't want any weeds. To sell those. I probably do before I want to go down there. I want to put away the fodder and process all the eggs and everything. You know what? Actually, even processing the eggs isn't that necessary because I just want a couple of stacks. But what is probably necessary is to go into the fridge and put all the grass away. I don't even know what I'm saving it for at this point. I should probably just sell a load of this stuff. But oh well. Good job, Sprites! How long have they got on their contracts now? They have six days left. Oh, that's loads of time. I always think it's loads of time and then I forget to check and I'm suddenly left without them for a day. I don't mind watering like three times a season though. <laughs> I can cope with that. No, I don't want that grass. Nope. It's gonna go in the mines and we're just gonna have a chill time hammering out some copper. 
which is just basically like gift after gift after gift that I can just give to Grey and Saibara. I may need my udons already. What? But yeah, I think I might want some gold to give to Huang as a present as well. So that, I may want to just go all the way down to like level 9 or so. And just grab some gold. Most of my tools are already upgraded to gold. So really, at the moment, it's only for selling and presents and stuff like that. Right, let's see if we can find the way down. Powering up does not work in here, just in case you wondered. I'm gonna try and just a lot of you are saying just just try and hoe around the uh, the rocks and then only if you can't find the way down and do you actually bash the rocks. Well, it won't be in either of those positions, so let's just bash this rock so I can get it out of the way, and then we'll just use the hoe right here. Wasn't going to be on those two patches either, actually. I'm just going to try and just hoe all the viable spots for a ladder. Yay! Level three. This is the way to do it, clearly. I'll just do that. That'll let me get through a few places. We're already at the level where we get silver, which is quite nice. But I'm after gold, which will be about level, I think it's about level six usually. So I get a few bits of gold. Nice to get a few little coins, although you only tend to get like about 20 for it. It's really good early on when you've got like no seed money at all. But later on, when you're making 6k and just animal products every day, it's probably not quite so good. I really should like rearrange this so the hoe is like closer. Alright, level five. I want to be at level six really. Let's see if I can find an entrance. Oh, lucky. I was super lucky with, with that. I think this should be the level where I get gold. And as I say, that was all I really wanted. Worth some gold. Oh, it seems like I'm getting copper down here, which is not ideal. Oh, there we are. There is some gold down in these here hills. <laughs> I'm like, oh, please don't just be just be copper down here. I'm starting to wonder if it was seasonal or something. So I just want to get as much gold as I can off this level. And we'll probably just go then. Um, I will just eat some udon. Make, make it through the day. But that stack of udon cost me about 500 gold. And that it's netting me all of this gold that I can use for gifts. So for me, making a decent amount of money each day. I'm not going to probably make a lot of money out of you know, all the, the mining I'm doing necessarily. Although I might make a bit of money out of it, I don't know. Uh, but it's definitely great for gifts. There's certain people that really love this as gifts. And that's all I'm really worried about right now. My farm is what's making me the money right now. I believe I only got two gold so far, that sucks. Clearly need to mine in the winter. Clearly got better stuff. Copper over there, I didn't pick up, yes. So we've got a bit of silver, we've got two pieces of gold. Um, there's not really enough. 
Hope I get some more. That's like two days worth of presents and I've spent 500 gold on it. Come on. I have to start giving him apples. I don't even have apple trees planted because they are really rubbish other than for giving us a gift. Gonna be honest with you. Okay, that's three days worth. Four days worth. I might make it down to level seven. Oh, I've got oranges actually, that would help. I'm gonna try and go down another level because I, I don't have much gold yet. <laughs> Thought I'd get more than that. But then again, like before I wasn't trying to mine for a lot of gold, I was just trying to mine for like whatever I could to get my tools upgraded. I only needed a total of about nine of them. So that probably wasn't so much of a worry for me at that point. But now I'm like, oh no. Okay, if I don't find the way down pretty soon, I'm gonna have to just leave, I think. However, we've got plenty, oh, I did find the way down, nice. I'm going to eat my black grass and some of my oranges. I can get some more oranges later on. That's in my fridge. I've got like about 70 of them. Oh, that was a thing I haven't done this episode and I need to do next episode probably is I haven't replaced my trees. I cut them all down. Or to be fair, actually, I haven't been able to get into Gots because one day was a, uh, his closed day and the other day was a festival day, so... I wasn't having much luck with that anyway. But next episode, I will try and get in and get my trees replaced so that we can get a good crop of oranges in for the next, like, six months or so. Basically, autumn and winter are oranges. Spring and summer are grapes. You can plant apples in between, but uh, I find that grapes and oranges give you a bit of a better stamina boost. So you can just save up a load of them and then take them down the mines. There's quite a few people that like oranges as a gift as well. So we managed to get eight gold. That's not too bad. I'll sell all the scrap ore and I'll keep some of the co and probably some of the copper ore actually. I'll keep some of the rest of it. Okay, no, I don't think I gave the Harvest Goddess a Prezi today. So we shall do that and then we've got a concert to go to. Oh, if it isn't she love, how lovely of you to come see me again. I always appreciate an offering. Okay, so I fed the cows, I let the chickens out, I fed Alison, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> we've got some uh, stuff to process and some stuff to sell. And uh, by the time I've done all that, it'll probably be time to head over to the church. Oops, wrong one. Yeah, I know you guys are saying um, all the time and I am ignoring you at the moment. But I know that I will need a few balls of yarn by the winter time. Right, let's have a chat. Hopgin, Ixius, Trist, Maple, Mona. That's everyone. Interest, maple, excess, pop and mona, yeah. Where's oh, my new baby rabbit? I'm excited. Oh, you guys have got some cheese to make. And if I, if I do have butter, I can sell that straight to Huang as well, but honestly, I'd probably just rather quickly sell these things. Uh, 
right, so I want to sell the, all this scrap ore as well. I won't sell for very much at all, but like because I didn't get a, a full inventory, I was like, well, I may as well. So I'm going to just sell maybe two stacks of this copper, keep another stack. And then I'm going to sell all of the silver. Well, like 18 presents to give out to um, Saibara and Grey, and then I've got like another nine, sorry, eight presents to give to Huang. Wonderful. Aww, are you missing your trees? Bet you are. Right, I'm gonna have a quick look at the, uh, oh, this is looking so nice, isn't it now? Oh, it's getting so satisfying. Um, the sprites. The nature sprites. See what they think of me. So sunny, mint and aqua like me quite a lot. So cherry, plum, pumpkin and blueberry. If I can. Pumpkin, come here. There you go. So I just gave uh, some honey to the least like the ones that like me the least. Just kid, just to keep them happy. But like, there's no one that likes me less than eight, so that's absolutely fine by me. I'm gonna put away one stack of this copper ore into my bookshelf and keep the rest on me. And I want to get a stack of oranges on me as well. And a piece of adamantine. Because I do feel like having a yarn maker in the barn would be highly useful. Just a little. I am going to run out of things to spend on eventually and that's when it will really start to stack up the money. Right, so it's time for that concert. Don't think I forgot. See, one of the problems with these festivals is I like to make them the like focus. Hello. Everyone's inside, let's go in. I was going to have you play the ocarina, correct? I'm looking forward to it. Shall we begin? See, like, I was waiting for a mini game on this one where I had to press all the different buttons for the ocarina tune, but it's fine. I don't have to. It's okay. Now then, ladies and gentlemen, please wait a moment while they take their places. So cute. Imagine Karen is singing. I bet she's a lovely singer. Now wait for this song to finish too. so pretty. I love little church concerts and, and little little sort of choir concerts in, in churches or like um, or in sort of the nice halls like the nice concert halls. I enjoyed that I should go again next year and it is 6am and it is time for me to end the episode there I think so we'll be just slowly working towards more stuff. This episode that's coming up autumn the 4th and 5th I think it's going to be a big one for animal births. I think we're definitely going to be getting a new rabbit. And I also think we're, de we're, we're possibly very close to getting a 
a new uh, alpaca. But I think it uh, might take a little longer because as I say, sometimes it takes some extra days and I think it's maybe based on missed feedings. So I might have a couple of extra days to wait. But uh, I will also next episode be trying to get a yarn maker for the barn. I'll maybe have a look and see if there's anything that looks kind of useful. Maybe some of the upgrades to the, the storage and things like that might be kind of useful. I'll have to see what I think. Um, I don't, I'm not finding particularly that I'm getting through the storage, but maybe as I start to cook more things and all that sort of stuff, then maybe I will. Not sure. But anyway, that is it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.